Today I'm thinking about the dangers of religion. The word religion comes from two words re equals again, and legion equals to bind or tie. It is from the Middle English religion, from Anglo-French religion, Latin religion religio which refers to supernatural constraint, sanction, religious practice, perhaps it comes from religion to restrain, tie back, to rely. I acquired the etymology from the Merriam-Webster online dictionary. Therefore religion is a system of beliefs whose sole purpose is to set up a boundary, restraint, to bind back to something. The reason religion exists is because it is a way to consolidate power and control over society and people. People want something to constrain them, if not then they would have to take responsibility for their own lives. However, if you have someone telling you what to do, and how to do it all the time, and if life doesn't come up to your expectation, then you can blame it on someone else except yourself. The danger of this is you fail to grow, this is why as parents, we try not to tell our kids what to do, and how to do things all the time, I'm not advocating that we allow children to do what they want to do, but there are some things they need to figure out themselves, with close supervision. I feel that we would stunt their growth intellectually and socially, if we do everything for them. For example, several years ago, I was watching a documentary about sloth and the teenagers were lazy, because their parents did everything for them, and thus obstructed them of growth and tools they would need later in their lives, I'm a witness that religion hinders growth. I'm an adult and I'm still apprehensive about taking risk, because all of my life I believed that I had to make the ultimate decision, choose Jesus of Nazareth as my Savior and Lord, and be saved, and live in bliss for eternity, or reject Him, and be damned for eternity. This decision was forever, and so I grew up with the idea that every decision I make has an everlasting consequence, and so even today I'm cautious making a decision. I agree with the philosopher Alan Watts' assessment that Christianity is the gambler's religion because you risk gaining everything or losing everything. Religion is dangerous because it is a system that already has everything laid out for you and you don't have to think for yourself. If it is not in the Holy Bible then you are afraid to risk it because that decision has eternal ramifications. Thus you are bound to absolutes of black and white when life has a lot of gray. In conclusion religion is dangerous because it diminishes growth, absolves personal responsibility, and eliminates critical thinking. Thanks for your time, please leave a comment, and if you like my dialogues feel free to subscribe.